tell if I wasn't too late to catch some of this. That day my one neighbor was uh, shooting off fireworks and well, <laughs> well, given what today is, you know, it's 4th of July. And a number of people are shooting off their fireworks. And, um, Oh, you hear a horse and buggy go by. <laughs> and one of my neighbors just walked outside. Dog barking for other obvious reasons. A couple of other folk are firing off fireworks, but they're a little too far away, a little over the ridge line, you know. Somewhere over in this direction. Not that it really matters to you because you can't really see anything. Be able to catch some from over that way. Just all some. And you, you are here and currently is a Amish buggy. You can tell they've, um, they're having fun. You know, you can hear it, I think. I know I can. Probably had a little too much to drink, in my opinion. Seems to do that. Ooh, right. There's always the one problem with these tree lines is you don't get a good view, and it's like you catch it at the wrong time, and... Not town celebrating, it's well It's not the town celebrating, it's celebration that is in August. Can't complain about that one. I really wish I had a really good camera to let me pick up, you know, the, you know, let me, you know, see in color, cause at the moment I'm. I yeah, got a little bit of something on that one. Everybody's shooting out their fireworks, everybody's having a good time.
Basically, everybody's having a good time thus far. Ooh, that was a nice one. I mean, granted, it's not a grand. The I mean, <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's kind of fun, you know. I mean, it's all amateur stuff. So I mean. Well, I had a... Uh, well, we got a little bit... Of, hopefully I got s some from down that way, I mean... Uh, well, we got a lot of good bangers going on down that way. And, of course, we got... A I don't think that one got caught. I wish I had a good uh, night's vision on this thing. I mean, I mean, it's probably a setting, but um, I just don't know the setting. Oh. Had a nice day, really. Um, um, brother's over. <laughs> he had a couple of red. That was a nice one. I think that was two of them. <laughs> really wish I had a good camera. Well, nothing else you can hear the booms and the bangs and the pops and all that. You might even hear the knee. There's uh, across the road a little bit. You know, you can kind of hear how excited they are. Um, <laughs> mosquito. Um, like I mentioned, my brother was here. My older one, anyways. And uh, over in that direction. <laughs> well, this is probably going to be one of those uh, informal stuff. I mean, everybody's shooting off their fireworks. Everybody but me. Don't I, I don't buy them because <laughs> I don't want to risk blow, blowing my fingers off. Or anything like that. And besides, I that was a close call. I almost missed that one. And you're going to hear a few more bangs in a little bit. Nope. I mean, I mean, all this is just, just folks in their backyard. <laughs> you know, I mean, I mean, this is the distance you want to be when it comes to watching fireworks. I mean, one, you're not jostling with. 
everybody to get that really good spot. Two. You, uh... You don't need to worry about the food as much, because, hey, it's your own cooking. You don't need to worry too much about any restrictions on beverages. <laughs> After all, you're on your own property. Um... Although, like I said, you're not jostling everybody for that really good spot to watch them. And also, you're far enough away that the booms... That was a nice one, too. So I'm shooting off some good ones over this way. Wouldn't be able to see him anyways, I'd have to get out in the driveway. Okay, someone's gonna shoot off the grand finale. By the sounds. Let's see what happens. Here it comes. Okay, someone's got a little some sparklers. <laughs> you know, low ground thingies. Probably just building up. <laughs> if you can hear my neighbors. Now let's see what else you got. <laughs> now it's producing a ni nice number of different colors. Just kind of hope it, you know, it's one of those ground ones, you know. Makes a whole lot of sparks and whatnot. Probably look better if it was up closer. I'll make that. Cause it looks good from my angle. If you can hear that, you can tell they were happy. <laughs> I hope that one wasn't thunder. Hmm. 
got to see about sitting down. That remains sitting down. Angle was not all that good. Well, and yeah, that was just me in the stick, you know. You can tell that they're enjoying themselves. <laughs> Wonder if they heard that. <laughs> I mean, it's one of those nights that sound carries. Part of the reason is why I am not talking real loud. You know what I mean? Yeah, by the sounds of it, the fireworks over there are over. <laughs> well, I am, uh, I'm going to get going. I'm going to, well, I'm going to, well, you know, I've been recording this for about almost 15 minutes. So, so Anyways, um, well, like I said, my brother was over here, you know, and he had a couple of raspberries, you know, red, black, and he had a gooseberry. And then I went over to a friend's place. Well, more like a friend of the family's family, you know. <laughs> they had a couple of their own fireworks. <laughs> You know, the ones that made a whole lot of noise, and then boom. Yeah. Then, uh, yeah, I mean, we just met up with this one guy who <laughs> was also interested in growing berries, you know, an older gentleman. I mean, always seems to be this, the older people that like gardening. Probably uh, because they remember when the garden made sure you had food. You know, they remember those times, you know, when they hear, heard the stories about how their mother, how their parents survived this hardship and that hardship. Now maybe they themselves went through this hardship and that hardship, you know. Yeah. It seems to be that some people don't have, really appreciate gardening. You know, and the person I went to, they had a nice garden, you know. They had, um, they had some uh, tomato plants, some pepper plants, some beans, and a few other things. Well, it's about 10 o'clock now. Probably going to be a little bit later by the time I get this uploaded. After all, I got work tomorrow, and, uh, well, tomorrow, things go all according to plan, I'll be, uh, planting some elderberries, you know, purchasing and planting elderberries, and hopefully you'll be able to see the aftermath of said planting, because I don't plan on showing you digging, uh, digging the holes and putting them in the ground, all right? I'll show you. I mean, you've seen me dig holes before. Well, this is Western New York, and I hope you folks out there are, especially in the United States of, of America, are having a good Fourth of July. Stay safe. And now, how some folks like to party, so be safe. You know. And, um, and, uh, well, 
Subscribe if you like this video. Hit the like button. Post comments. I mean, tell me how was your 4th of July? Alright? Well, goodbye.